Adjust your actuation point to get the fastest input or a comfortable typing response. Now remember, there is no best actuation point. You have to look at what is best for you. So let's set it up. When you're in the utility, you can see the performance tab in each profile and that's where you can set the actuation point for all the keys. Now remember that the activation point represents when the key activates during the key press. If you set a lower number, which is a higher position, it will activate much earlier. If you set it at a higher number, which is a much lower position, it will activate much later. When you're adjusting the slider, you can see for which keys it's adjusting it for. Now let's say you want to adjust it for just a singular key. That's possible. Just click on the per key activation point. Simply left click or drag your selection and adjust the activation slider. You can deselect keys with right click. If you made a total mess of everything, you can always refer to the global activation point by clicking the red button. Now I recommend to observe your typing behavior or your game behavior to see what is a good activation point for you because lower is not always equal to better. So for example, what I did is all my WASD keys are in 0.1 millimeter activation, but all the keys surrounding it are around 1.2 or 1.5 depending on how important that key is. Now you find your way and that's it. Bye-bye.